to another Jane of All Trades tutorial short. Today we are just going to quickly package a project. So the project I've got in front of me is my Premiere project template. Just very easy to work with. So what we do is we go to file, we go to project manager and here we have name of our, the name of this is actually the name of our timeline you can see here so that th these can be renamed if you wish to rename your projects. You've got collect and copy to new location and you've got consolidate and transcode. I just leave it to collect and copy and here you have the options of what you want it to include. Abs again I've selected absolutely everything and then you've got your destination path. I want it to go to completed projects but you can change that. You could have it sent to the desktop. Here in this space it shows you how much this space you've got available on that drive and you can calculate what the project is going to be. So this is all elements that I have chosen to export so the size is exactly the same. If you were using quite a lot of footage and you had a lot of b-roll and it was all involved in your project, what to keep in mind is that if you're exporting in this manner, it will not take any unused data. So if you want to keep your b-roll aside for a future project, then you're better off just keeping the full original folder. Uh, I do this for my YouTube mostly, where I've got edits and bits and pieces lying around that I'm really never going to use and I'm never going to return to. So normally my project size will drop by about 50%. So it saves you some drive space and it keeps everything nice and tidy. And then in the end you just click OK and then it, it asks you if the operation is required to be saved. And then when you click yes, what it does is it just consolidates all your elements, all your images, all your videos and your project file into one folder in your specified location. And that's it now, all tucked away and packaged, ready to either move on to another party or just for your own personal use that one day you may go back and reopen or change that project in the future. So that's how you export slash package or project manage in Premiere Pro CC 2020. Feel free to like, feel free to subscribe and thank you very much for watching. Goodbye.